Kane, it's a, it's been a few days since the the Falkirk game. Has as the squad been able to get refocused and, and prepare for Peterhead properly? Yeah, now we're just all focused on the next game. Um, obviously buzzing with the result against uh, Falkirk, but obviously the next game is important. So now uh, just looking forward to that one. What is your expectations heading up to Peterhead this weekend? What kind of game do you think we're in for? It's going to be tough. Um, I think obviously they're fighting to stay up and stuff like that. So it's going to be another tough game. I think as they've shown when we played them at home, they made it tough. And in the few games we played them, it, they've made it tough. So uh, it's just another game that we're going to go into and try and win. The last time we went up there, we, we won 2-0 and we were able to, as you said, overcome a, a tricky opposition, a, a tricky ground for us. So it's about going up there, starting the final quarter the way we want to, to go on over the, the remainder of the nine games. Yeah, no, I'll try and start as quick as we can and um, hopefully it leads us on to a good result. Um, yeah, but like I say, it's, it's going to be a difficult game. We've just got to keep our heads switched on. For yourself personally, and I know we've sat down and spoke a couple of times about your, your own spell here, and uh, you, again, you must be really pleased with the way things are going, but there must be continual kind of challenges put in front of you that you're managing to overcome. The one that I was thinking of was in terms of the, the kind of pressure and the, the, the expectation levels maybe over the last couple of games, and, and not just yourself, but the squad in, in general has been able to deal with them, stand up, get the victories that we've required to put us in a really good position in the league? No, nah, it's been massive, obviously. Just need to keep this run going and stay confident. I think that's how we've been all season. And now nah, I've enjoyed it. I've enjoyed this whole loan, this this experience. You know, it's been massive for my, for my development personally. And, you know, I just want to keep that going. You... Uh, maybe quite luckily for the from the referee's point of view, sent you off round by the the northwest um, on uh, Saturday, uh, Tuesday. Sorry, when you got substituted, and that allowed the supporters to to sing out your name as well. So you must feel really satisfied that the fans are are, are appreciative of the, your efforts on the park. Yeah, no, nah, it's it's amazing. Obviously, to hear them chant my name as well, it was it was amazing. Um, no, nah, it's just, obviously, to go off that side, I was going to go off the other side. It's probably the refs helped me, to be fair, um, get that reception. So, no, I'm just grateful for it all. Again, though, touching on the, the supporters, I mean, it was a sold-out home end. Um, how did it feel out on the park with that kind of atmosphere? Have you experienced anything like that before, or was that Tuesday night something completely new to yourself? No, nah, it, was, it was definitely new. Um, I think the fans have been amazing all season, and, you know, for this game, it was huge, and... They came out in numbers, you know, sold it out, and that was incredible. And Peterhead, all the way up north, but we'll still take a, a good following behind us. And is that just as crucial at the away games to, to see them in big numbers and, and hear them when you, you come out, not just for the warm up, but for the game as well? Yeah, definitely. It pushes us on for the um, the game, and you know, seeing them all turn up in numbers every game is is crucial, I think. And now they're a big help.